What it do, Flight Crew? FTC. Flight Team, stand up! It may be May, but June is on the way. We got the 2024 NBA Draft Lottery. The 14 teams I missed the NBA playoffs, including, unfortunately, my Warriors. We will be seeing what the draft uh, picks will be looking like. Now, the title is, I see, kind of spoiled. Thanks, NBA Chaz. But we got, uh, it says, ATL's going to win a number one pick, and the Pistons get the five. So we already get spoiled with that. Every other team, I don't know, especially for my team. So let's check it out. In the it's just got uploaded. I got to move my webcam. I know the draft takes place in like June, by the way. Presented the by actual State draft. Farm will be made by the Portland Trailblazers. As expected, Portland received so Portland this got pick from fourteen. Golden State, who could only have kept his pick if it had landed in the top four. Mm. The thirteenth pick belongs to. Mm, you heard that? That's interesting. Landed in the top four. That's interesting. Let me hear it. Receives this pick from Golden State, who could. Twenty-four NBA draft presented by State. It says something about my Warriors. Farm will be made by. The Portland Trailblazers. As expected, Portland receives this pick from Golden State, who could only have kept his pick if it had landed in the top four. Oh, so we get that pick. And then we get another pick because it's part of the draft lottery, right? Damn, that's crazy because of the whatever the trade, whatever we traded for. And uh, uh, basically in the contract, it literally stated... If you had a top four pick, you get to keep the pick. If you want it off of that, like, you know, lottery pick, draft lottery, you know what they do. I think, dude, the last time I, like, like seen a full draft lottery was probably, like, 2007. Do they still do it where they jumble up the balls and you have to, you know, go inside and then, like, grab one and then just you pick out a random one or whatever? But that's interesting to know. The 13th so we still got another chance to get another pick, right? Belongs we got to just see. Number 13, the, the Kings. Picking 12. Bro, look mad as fuck. Old KC. What? How the hell are the Thunder right now playing in the playoffs? And they got a top 15 pick. This is exactly why, bro. Yo, now I'm realizing, bro, this shit is all a bit. I mean, I've been new about it. it's a business, but like, it's really, it's a business business, bro. Like, this just goes to prove you, and I may sound crazy for saying this, I mean, just hear me out. Like, they seen the Warriors was nonstop just dominant in the NBA for like three to four seasons straight, and then we just won another championship after they tried to count us out in 2022, right? And so, like, all of a sudden, bro, yo, the NBA is now trying to push the OKC Thunder, bro. Like, I'm seeing it with my own eyes. Everybody's seeing it with their own eyes, right? And it makes no sense. How does this team even have a, a chance to even have a top 25 first round pick? They're still playing the playoffs right now. And it looks like they're probably going to advance on to the next round, if we're being honest. That shit is crazy as hell. This clear as day, the NBA just favors and picks teams from different like cities and markets every five to ten years that they want to push and that they, you know what I'm saying, just want to refreshen up the NBA, man. Come on, man. It's just like it's, it's all like business, business, and politics, bro. Expected man. OKC receives this pick from Houston due to the Russell Westbrook Chris Paul trade. That don't even make sense, bro. Even if that was like the case, like there needs to be some like type of like 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 rule thing in there. Like if the team is playing currently in the playoffs in the second round, it, 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 it like uh you know disintegrates the pick or some shit. If I'm using the right vocab word, and and then the Rockets because they just said that the Rockets are supposed to have this and then they traded. Yo, that don't make no sense, bro. The 11th pick in the NBA draft will go to the Chicago Bulls. Bulls, okay. Bro, look mad, man. <laughs> Pick number 10 will be made by the Utah the Jazz. Jazz. This means that Atlanta Bro, and Houston face. have both moved into the top four. You see those smiles. <laughs> the ninth pick goes to the Memphis the Grizzlies. Grizzlies. Okay. Is that Tayshaun Prince? What do you know about the Prince? The pick will be made by... The Sperms? Bro, I ain't gonna lie. If they don't at least make the playoffs next season, bro, like Popovich gotta like either retire or they gotta fire him before they get to him uh, before he retire, bro. Like, yo, because apparently like two of you ain't been looking at the rumors, they're supposed to get Trey from uh from uh, 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 ATL to Trey Young. And that was actually will be very fire. Trey Young and a Wimby duo, bro. But, and then now they get a top 10 pick. And then also, how are the draft prospects looking this year? I think I, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I know Bronny's supposed to be in the draft. 
And that's honestly all I know is like Bronny's like the uh, you know the, the only the top five pick that I know that's gonna be in the 2024 draft apparently. Um, I, I had to look at the uh, the mock draft the list again. Seven. So that means the Warriors got a top ten pick then. Antonio receives this pick due to the Yaka Pirtle trade. Had the pick remain in the top six, would have stayed with Toronto. The seventh pick in the NBA draft belongs to the Portland Trailblazers. What? This means that San Antonio has also moved into the top four. Oh, so San Antonio has another pick? How does Portland have like two? Obviously, we got that 14th pick because they didn't get that top four. Pick number six goes to the Hornets. Hornets. Hornets have gotten top seven picks the last five seasons, bro. Yo. The fifth pick will be made by the, the Pistons. Pistons. That sucks. It was the worst team in the NBA this season, and you get only the fifth pick, which is still... It can be good, but at the same time, you know, you should at least get the top three. But that means the Warriors are the top four pick, right? Unbelievable. Already some wrinkles. The fourth pick in the NBA draft goes to... Already some wrinkles. What are they? The San Antonio the Spurs. Spurs. another four pick. Yo, the Warriors get a... The third pick belongs to... The Houston Rockets. The Rockets, the third. And then the second got to be the Warriors, right? The second pick will be made by the Washington Wizards. Bro, how? And then obviously next is going to be ATL to the Tile Sporter. In the 2024 NBA draft goes to the Atlanta Hawks. Bro, what? These niggas made the playoffs. Didn't the Hawks make the part of the play -in? I know that I'm mad too. They talking mean shit. I'll be mad too. Bro, how the hell the Hawks get? Bro, why do the Warriors not have a top five pick? This is what I was just talking about, marketing and politics of the NBA, bro. Hi, so you mean to tell me the only pick that we got in the first round of the draft is a 14th pick, and that was because of a stupid-ass, like, contract clause that they had that if they didn't get a top-four pick because of the stupid lottery pick system that they are using to just jumble up a whole bunch of balls and you just grab a random and you just hope... Bro, that doesn't make no sense. This means that back to back to back seasons, bro, we do not we didn't have the top five picks since the uh the, the 2019 draft, right? With the James Wiseman and shit. Bro. This shit is rigged, bruh. This is the worst draft lottery in history, dude. And it's rigged. So this obvious is the obvious thing that they're gonna be trading uh Trey Young in. They're gonna get a first round draft pick, they're gonna get a guard, right? to end up with the number one pick they have never won the lottery before and here is what the they never order. won a lottery before so the warriors had that 14 pick if you didn't realize because the, the, this 14 pick for the blazers was was ours the nba so they didn't get top a four jump with the rockets and atlanta for the first time in franchise damn bro i ain't gonna lie man this ain't it bro they need to change up the way the draft lottery and stuff is and rules. Like, because, bro, the ATL, they was literally in the play-in and they get a number one overall draft pick. How is that even fair? And personally, if I'm the Pistons, I'm pissed. Because, you know, for a damn fact, after All-Star break, they knew they was out of the playoffs. So that means they, I'm not saying they probably was, but most of the time, they didn't give a fuck about winning. So that means technically what? What is that word? Tank? So imagine them purposely trying to tank. And even a Wizards, I mean, the Wizards got a second pick. The second and the first pick is always the best, I guess. But it's like, bro, I don't know, man. This draft lottery stuff isn't it, man. Um, y'all comment down below if y'all feel like they need to change this up, man. Um, this isn't fair. My Warriors should have at least at lowest ball got a seven overall, like a top seven pick. You know, man.